Hey guys, today we're going to be looking at a K98 bayonet, or more specifically the M84-98 model bayonet for the German K98K rifle. If anybody wants to know, I bought this particular example from a website called Field Service Militaria and Antiques, if I remember correctly, and it was £85. My example is dated 1939, and it has the maker's name on the blade. I'll give you a close-up of that now. At the back segment of the blade, near the grips, it is marked E. Pack and Sons, which was one of the many smaller companies which was contracted to produce these bayonets for all branches of the German military at the time. This particular example has the more common bake-like grips. You'll also find some with the wood grips, but those are considerably rarer and you don't come across them quite as often. This is the release button. Once it's clipped over the bayonet lug, you then depress this button, which slides a portion out of the left side, disengaging it from the notch on the bayonet lug. It can then be slid off. The blade is 9.9 .9 inches in length, and it's all machined out of one block of steel. The blade on this is in nice condition. It's seen a lot of the bluing has been worn over time and through use. It also has a little dent in the blade there. Let's see if I can give you a close-up on that. That's probably where it has contacted another bayonet or possibly hit something. So, likelihood, this example has been used in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Very nice example. Really happy to have it. The sheath did come with it. Not in quite as equal condition. Uh, it's seen a little bit more use. The paint's wearing off a little bit. This is the stud which is designed to fit inside your bayonet frog. Basically like a button in a shirt. Just clips over there and then you carry your bayonet on your waist. You can generally pick these up for about 80 to 120 pounds depending on year, maker and of course condition. This is a very nice example. Most of them you will find will be in this kind of condition. It's hard to find them in very good condition. If you can find one in excellent condition, which is pre-war with wood grips, that's probably about the best combination you could get. A rare maker also helps. So thanks for watching. That's been the look at the German K98 bayonet.